Oh, we got some news you can use. Yes, right. What's up? All right. So we need a paper plumber on this number. Yeah. You know you like it. Yeah. 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 Paper Mario. Color Splash. Y'all be hating. We get it in cash. Paper Mario. Color Splash. What? is going on everybody how are y'all doing quick 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 news item dope 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 news before we get started with this video give the video a huge thumbs up breaking breaking news for the new super mario game coming to the nintendo switch in 2023 all new 2d mario game and a big bombshell has just been reported. First, the game has just wrapped up development. This is coming from GamesRadar.com and we have some dope, dope, dope news. First, the game has wrapped up development, which is dope. All but confirmed it's coming in 2023 and this is the big news. Princess Peach will be one of the playable characters. In fact, they're going all the way back to the Mario 2 days on the Super, I mean not on the Super Nintendo, on the NES, where you can choose between Mario, Luigi, uh, Princess Peach, and Toad. So, this is coming from a blogger, Zippo, who has shared various Nintendo leaks over the years and has been right. <coughs> so, always take these rumors with a grain of salt, but um, according to the original, uh, the original leak was Nintendo's currently working on a 2D Mario game. Although similar to the new Super Mario Bros. series, this game will apparently be its own thing and won't use the new Super name tag. Thank you. We need to get rid of the new Super Mario. They milk this um, series to death, bro. This art style, I got tired of it after a while. They need something new and fresh. Mario is the king of 2D platformers, bro. He, like, started the wave. And in so many ways, other games have surpassed it. They need some innovation, but <laughs> I am glad a, a rumor that I reported months ago that they are changing up the art style. It's going to be something new and fresh, which I'm hyped for. But um, Zippo has released an updated update on the new Super Mario 2 game, which he, they said it's been in development for over three years. The game has been in development for over three years and um, has just about wrapped up. All right, he's claiming that Takashi Tezuya and Hiroyuki Kimura, who have worked on the Mario series for a long time, has also returned um, on this game. All right, this is the big news. Fans will be able to play as Mario, Luigi, Peach, and Toad. So this is going to be the first time in almost 35 years ever since Super Mario 2 on the um, NES, love that game, love that game. That um, Princess Peach will be a playable character in a mainline Mario game. I think Peach had her own game, like on the DS or something like that, but it wasn't considered a mainline game. So that's dope, that's dope, that's dope. Um, now, super, they, and they do note that New Super Mario U Deluxe, it did sort of had Princess Peach um, <coughs> in disguise um, where you can play as um, Toadette and she floated just like Princess Peach but it wasn't Princess Peach so this is dope this is dope this is dope um, 2d Mario games are always we are long overdue for and I said this for a time period we're getting like back to back to back um, 2d Mario games and after um, New Super Mario, I think it was 2 on the um, DS or 3DS, where you had to get the coins. Coins was the whole theme. I wasn't ripped. That was my first time, like, alright, they need to pump the brakes on Mario 2D Mario games. 
but now they waited. It's been a few years. Um, it's, we're, we're ready for a new Super Mario game. Now, this is what I'm thinking. If this launches with a new Switch, oh, it's going to sell like crazy, bro. It's going to sell like crazy. If they do what they did with the DS Lite, y'all remember? Um, the DS was, it was selling good, but it was struggling a little bit. When they uh, announced the DS Lite, uh, um, brighter screen, smaller form factor, and launched it with new Super Mario Brothers, it was a wrap. From then, the DS, I think the DS is like one of the best selling consoles of all time, handhelds of all time. If they do the same thing, launch this new Super Mario game with uh, a new Switch, Give us better specs on the Switch. <laughs> a more powerful Switch. That would be dope. That would be dope. And um, Nintendo, if they do this during the holiday of 2023, it's a wrap. I, I talked about yesterday how um, Sony is going to be having um, Spider-Man 2 as their holiday title for the PS5, which is going to be huge. And I was like, doesn't matter what Xbox does. Xbox does not have a title on the caliber of Spider-Man 2, um, it's not gonna be able to compete with it. But, if Nintendo <laughs> releases a Mario game during the holiday season, Mario Trump Spider-Man, in the video game world, in the video game world, Nintendo's first party IPs, nobody can touch them. I mean, that's just factual. You could just go look at the numbers. It's just unbiased, that's just factual. So, this is dope stuff. New Super Mario, more information on the um, new Super Mario game coming to the Switch 2023, and you can now play as Princess Peach. Before we end this video, I got to let y'all also know, Nintendo just announced on Nintendo Switch Online, Yoshi Story on the Nintendo 64 is now available. You know what? I want to play this game. I played it on the Nintendo 64, but I never played it that far i never got far in the game but it looks dope it looks it's like a fun game looks like a fun game one of the games i probably slept on so uh yoshi story is now available on nintendo 6 online on the nintendo 64 services i don't know why i thought this game was already available on the on this nintendo switch online i honestly thought this was already available all right those are all of the news items <coughs> for this video your boy's still sick after coming back from Mexico. It is what it is, bro. What do you guys think about everything we talked about? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All thanks. Nen. Ten. Don't. We out. Bye. Outro. This channel that I'm about to throw out there for you guys reminds me of me back when I had, like, 4,000, 5,000 subscribers, man. And um, he's probably gonna lose shit when I do this, but hey, man, I gotta say, my boy OB1, my boy OB1, man, that nigga is my nigga right there. He reminds me exactly of me when I was doing this shit on a smaller level. His channel, when I look at it, it's such a nostalgia trip. And he has a really cool audience, too. Hey, and if you could show this nigga some love, too, that'd be awesome. I don't shout people out unless I like them a lot. A lot. I'm picky with that. Um, anyways, my boy Obi Wan, your boy Obi Wan. Hey man, I got you right here, my boy. Get that man a little bit of a look, man. He reminds me of me when I was smaller. You want to take a look in the past, my boy? This is the way you do it. I got you, Jedi homie. Master the right Jedi Obi Master. <laughs> I got you, man. You're playing two towers. I got you, homie. I'm dedicating a workout set. To <laughs> you, my boy. Let's go, guys. Four, twenty-five. 26, 27, 28. Ah, he said he ain't on the end.